Now, the game we'll do first is Farming Simulator 22, because it's really simple. So you right click on your display, like so. I will have to go into the GoPro scene selection. You just click this, tick here, span displays with surround. Go to configure surround, Fizz X, whatever it is, push apply. Now this screen will load up, so I'll go to my triples, or well, GoPro. Just say this will load up. Now you need to match up which uh, screen your numbers are. So three for me is over to my right. Two is over uh, left. Sorry, two is to my right. One is in the middle. Make sure you select your resolution to the highest, which mine is 5760 by 1080p. Hertz on the highest, and then push enable surround. Your screens will go funny, but it's alright, it's normal. I'll do some things. Check if it's all working, mine's working fine. There you go, put that over there. And then close that down, you don't need that open anymore. Now, what you need to do... I need to disable that one. What you need to do now, put my <laughs> triple screens back on. There you go. What you need to do now is go and launch Farming Simulator 22. So you don't need to do anything um, spectacular to FS22 at all. Um, so just launch FS22. We will be covering ETS2 as well, so bear with me. Oh, God. Sorry, very tired. Let's wait for FS22 to load. There we go. Yeah, I was trying to find an upload um, transition today, but couldn't do it. So anyway, go into your settings, options. Go into your display. So, when you're in here, make sure you turn on turn your screen resolution all the way to the top. I've done this before, um, so if I'll make show an example. Um, I'm around 1980 by 1080p, and you'll see what will happen. Look, I'm very stretched. Well, you won't see that, but I'll put the GoPro on. Very, very stretched look. So this is your this is the problem my uh, you had. Um, the guy who commented on my uh, YouTube. Can't remember your name off by heart. I do apologize. But yeah, put up, set it to your highest resolution like this. Push play again. It'll do a lot of gimmicky glitches, glitchy things. Then you're back into triple screens. I'll quit the game. Now, if you can't choose a size, what I suggest you do. Let's go back in here and change your resolution here. And then go back and do the surround. So you might have the wrong resolution selected here. So well, you're going to have to make your own. Right, anyway, move on to ETS 2. I, before I do that, I would like to get the name of the person I'm helping. I do feel really bad. So one second. The guy's name is Rogue3Plague. So, hopefully this will help you. Anyway, ETS2 now. So, obviously what you do, same thing. Now, I um, remain in uh, triples all the time. So just make sure you remain in this. Um, if you want to do screenshots, I'll show you how to. If you're, if you're a YouTuber, you don't have to leave your triples anymore. But anyway, what you do, because I wasn't running triples at all. I was running single I was running single screen but in triples. But for some reason it worked because I had Navidia Inspector installed. Anyway, what you do first things first, go to your config, right click if there's no notepad, and then push open with, select notepad and put always. 
this will launch up. Now what you do is go to edit, find next, put in multi, and then go down, 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 down. Right, what you need is this. This is really important, so what you need to do is you need to put multi one to two, right? Now this I don't know what this is set by um default um, standards but if you select two that's your triples this is your uh, triple uh, screens right okay so number two is triples but that's two you want the vov to 70 like so um, and then you want to put rotation right minus 0 0.9 rotation left 0 0.3 like so Camera pitch, set that to one. Put uh, put the interior in main one. That's all you need to do. Um, yeah, that's it. Seriously, that's literally it. So there's also this is not related to this topic, but if you push, if you put, <coughs> <coughs> but if you find console in here, put one on the console developer as well. Uh, etc etc and that will uh, help you I'm just going to do something on my own don't follow what I'm doing I'm running NVIDIA GeForce and uh, NVIDIA Inspector so I'm just um, looking at things here I'm trying to look for uh, texture uh, here it is one second I'm going to turn this up to max anyway that's it. Push save. So I'm in triples at the moment. Yours might be set to four or zero. Now go and launch your truck simulator. Where is that? There. Th that works for ATS as well, by the way. So, yeah. Works with ATS too. Uh, with ATS. So you could do the same thing. Now push play on your truck. I've found my first Euro Truck um, game today, uh, the first game they ever made, uh, but the disc was uh, snapped in half, so I'm going to have to buy it again, probably on uh, Steam this time, so yeah, that a bit good, but never mind. to take time to load but yeah I've been playing ETS 2 live and ATS not being in triple mode triple screens so I'm a little annoyed to be honest I don't play a single screen it's why when I when I uh, when I tap out of the game when I come back in the screens are black it's because of that so never mind how triples have worked uh, in the first place I don't know so there we go we're in now what you do is you go into your graphics obviously set your resolution to the highest again but I'll show you a trick I hope it works so I know it looks tiny the box but when it's like this I'll show you on my GoPro when it's like that you could take um, screenshots but it will pick it up as a single screen. So don't worry. <coughs> so when I'm making my thumbnails for my games for YouTube. This is how I do it. But don't worry. It's not like bugged. It's just the menu is tiny. The game look is fine. It's just the menus will be small. So it might be different for you. I'm running a special mod for the graphics. It might be completely different for you guys. But as you can see. For me. I'm a single screen, it works fine. So that's what I do if I want to make a, uh, a screenshot. I don't know why the menu is so small. Um, just taking some pictures for thumbnails, take advantage of it. So, but yeah, so people don't leave your triples. You don't need to. 
it's really not needed. Um, so, just some advice for you guys. So yeah, so that's that. So obviously, go back into it. I don't want audio. Go back into it. Like so. And I'll put this back to triples. So that's the quick and easy tip for me, for you, if you're a YouTuber and you don't want to be doing it. So, don't want to be doing, um, coming out of your triples. And obviously when you do that on my screen, for some reason, the whole screen goes into this game thing. It probably doesn't happen a lot to people, but uh, this is how I get, um, this is how I used to get my navigation off my screen, because my navigation screen is on my left hand side, so you guys can't see it. So, yeah, that works still anyway. But anyway, let's quit the game. So yeah, that's the quick and easy way, guys. Um, that really is it. There's no more to it. Um, if you want to obviously cheat the game, well, not cheat the game, but if you want to be doing that, then I think everybody knows how to do it. Um, all you need to do, guys, is go into the config file again, open it with Notepad, go down, and all you have to do is turn on console and all that other good nonsense. Developer needs to be on. So push one in developer. Oh. And then one in console. Like so. So console. Developer. One, one. And that's pretty much it. And you can start uh, putting anything you want in the... Um, what's it called? In the thing magic. If you want your fly speed, um, for some reason mine's set to 55, 5, 1, 1. Just put that in. Um, that's pretty much it. So, developer and console. And then you'll have a console up. Push save, obviously. Anyway, guys, I hope that's helped you. Um, if the problem persists, let me know, Rogue. If that's your name, if I'm saying it right. But, uh, I hope that's helped you. You just need to change your resolution. If you have any issues, just comment on the video. Um, it's probably because you need to select your resolution. To be quite, f to be fair, you're, I think you're doing this process right. This process, and also set your processor as your graphics card. You're probably doing the process right. The problem you're having is. Um, you can't seem to be, you don't seem to have the, um, you don't have, you don't seem to have the right resolution, sorry. Sorry, I was concentrating on something else. So, I'm thinking, you can customise it in this look. So, You can create your new custom, but I can't because I don't... Well, I can, but I don't want to, so... No, no. <laughs> so no, no from me. But anyway, I hope that's helped. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed that tutorial. I know it's a bit... Um, it was like... A straight to the point video, but I hope that's helped you. I know it wasn't very um, exciting, because I've got like a black uh, screen. But I hope that's helped. Any issues, let me know. Take care, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.